Hey guys, Jude here. Today's Tuesday. And my god, I know I said on the vlog a while ago, but I can't speak words. I know I said on the vlog I was gonna be like all productive and stuff. I was gonna do stuff. I was gonna edit vlog every day. And it's like, lo and behold, like everyone, you know, probably thought when I said that. And obviously, if you, if you were watching, you know, because you were there at the time. Uh, anyway, I didn't do any of that. Uh, which is partially because. I'm lazy piece of shit, but also partially because of what happened the other day with the computer thing. It was a very, oh, context, I guess. So, Xavier broke my laptop screen, and obviously it's not that bad, but it's still, like, broken, and it's still under warranty, so I don't know if they would cover that, but in the event that they do, I don't know, I still want to get it fixed, obviously, because it's the kind of thing that's going to get worse over time. Like, it'll keep getting worse. And so, I figured I'd get it fixed while I can maybe have it be done with the warrant. I don't know. Anyway, I'm just saying this because I was pretty bummed out about that, understandably, for the past couple days. Still am. I haven't even used the laptop in a while, which is why I haven't edited anything. And it's unfortunate because it's going to be Wednesday tomorrow. And I'm going to have to use the thing to record Luigi because I said I wanted to get that done before Wednesday so Wednesday could be a nothing day because it's the day before I go to work and that's not gonna happen because I didn't record it before Wednesday because I've been all bummed out and sad but it's fine it's fine I'm feeling sort of better uh, I gotta fix my sleep schedule it really messed up my sleep schedule too because I got home that day and I was like it was like 6 a.m. went to bed woke up at 2 and that's not good either. <laughs> that's not good. But yeah. I'm gonna have to... Well, after I record this, I'm just gonna go straight to sleep. And then I'm gonna wake up. And I'm gonna eat, I'm going to eat something. And then I'm going to set up to record. And regardless of the laptop's screen. And I might... Uh, I might even record using the new computer in the because of... I already have the graphics, not the graphics card, but I already have the thing plugged into that. What's it called? A capture card. I already have that plugged into the back of the thing, so I might just record using that. But then again, my settings are on the, uh, and I, you know, eh, I don't feel like unplug. If I did that, I would have to unplug the the hard drive bays into the computer, so I'm just gonna do it on the laptop anyway. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I hopefully, well, I wanna just, like, immediately just get it fixed next week, the laptop, because I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I don't wanna wait too long, and I don't wanna, like, have it get worse. I don't, uh, it's one of those things that sucks because you can't, like, call an Apple store and get, like, a quote. They'll tell you, oh, well, with Apple Care Plus, it'll be a hundred bucks. I'm like, yeah, I know it would, wouldn't it? Huh. You have to go there, they have to look at it, and the closest Apple store is Albany, so that's two and a half hours away. And then it's probably going to be one of those, like, we'll have to keep it overnight thing because, eh, whatever. I don't even know if I said what happened yesterday, but basically what happened was the laptop was in a bag, in the laptop bag, and it was, like, on a, on a shelf thing, just sitting there, and Xavier was pissed off, he was pissed off about, I don't know if I can remember, something about, probably the shows or something, and he just like punched the table, like really hard, obviously, and the laptop was there, and I am surprised, partially surprised that it didn't, like the screen is like, just like, oh, it's just weak there, and there's a line, instead of being like, you know, liquid crystal spill all over the thing, which I shouldn't be surprised, because it's metal, right? But I am kind of surprised because of how light this thing is. I've been treating it like like it's fragile. I kind of wish like Apple would make their laptops heavier and thicker simply because it's so thin and light that it feels fragile. It feels like it would break if you like I don't like I don't even know. Which is like the worst this thing has ever experienced was when I was streaming or setting up a stream once on the couch there with them. It was on this table, this uh, piano bench thing, 
and I tripped over a cable and it flew off while it was open and just fell on the ground and it was completely fine. It was no, not even a scratch, a dent or anything. Uh, my cat fell off this table once back and like her, her claws went on the thing and it left what I thought was scratch marks and I'm like, no, no, but it was just like the, her, na her claws like scraped off on it and it was just dust. Anyway, he punched it really hard and the screen is broken and it sucks. It's not, it's like I said, I showed it in the other vlog. You can watch that if you want. I don't feel like looking at it right now, but it's just, it's just a faint purple line. And then if you push on the screen, you can see that the entire right side is like, you know, liquid crystal glowing. It's not leaking. It's not spilling or anything like that. It might if you keep pressing on it, but it's it's not. It's just, it's not even like discolored or anything. It's not as, it's not like it's not as bright over there. It's just, there's a purple line and there's, it's weak on one side. And I know this is the most like petty rich person bullshit. Like, oh, there's, there's a line on the screen, but it's, and it's not even a bad line. It's like faint, but it's just, I would like that to be fixed. And he said he said that he fully understands and that he would he would pay for it in full. I offered that I offered half because I knew because it's Apple it would either be really fucking expensive or really fucking expensive. So dead pixels and shit pisses me off. It feels like something that should just you know a problem that should just be solved, but obviously it's not. It's like one of those like like the common cold. Like we shouldn't get the common cold anymore. Allergies should be cured. But it's not, because it's not really a priority. It's something that we can just live with and eh, whatever. Uh, but in the moment, it sucks. It sucks really bad, and I feel like we should we should be beyond that at this point. But, you know, and dead pixels are like that too. Why, when I get a display and it has a bunch of dead pixels, can I not get a replacement, you bastard? Uh, I paid for all the pixels, but really, it's it honestly doesn't matter. Actually, uh... You can't see it, it's on the ground. But the old TV, the 50 inch TV, was that, when I got that, well actually that died. And then because I had it in warranty, they replaced it with a TV that was like, had a different casing, but it was the same sort of model. Uh, and that had a dead pixel until I threw something and it hit the TV. I didn't even throw something at the TV. I was standing there where my computer used to be and the TV was over on that orange wall there. And I threw something, and it just like, you know, because the wind carried it, it went back, hit the TV right where the dead pixel was. I looked, the dead pixel was gone. It was like magic. And speaking of dead pixels, my laptop had a dead pixel when I first got it. In fact, when I first got the laptop, I haven't recorded, I recorded an unboxing video for it too, and I never uploaded it, because I was like, I'm going to put this in my video of me collecting Max, because I was also making a video of that as I was doing that. I don't know if I can find the dead pixel. But there was a tiny little dead pixel up here somewhere. That uh, uh, that kind of pissed me off a lot, even though I knew I would I would get over it and I would never see it because of how tiny it is. But I just knew that there's a dead pixel up there, and if you can find it, there it is. I'm not even gonna bother trying to record that. But I, what I can record is a little chip in the metal. That was there when I opened the thing out of the box and there's a little sharp thing sticking up and I shaved it off so that it wouldn't cut the screen. But for some reason, my dumbass never thought, hey, this is obviously a defect, you know, out of the box, out of the factory. I could probably, you know, get it just instantly replaced. But eh, it was for to me, it was like, ah, that's small enough. Like, I don't care. Uh, and I, you know, shaved it down so that it wouldn't stab the screen when I closed the lid. I'll see you guys tomorrow. This has been a very long vlog, isn't it? Probably. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah.